Repetitive tracks that I can't tell you from one or another. Right. Honestly, like you'd have to really send me a text or something to tell me the track changed. Right. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I want to hear music. I want to hear music the way it was supposed to be. Right. So, so you're putting out some music on Saturday night sessions. Tell us what we can find there. Um, we just put out a couple tracks. One of them is uh, Backman did Crush. We just released that. It's available everywhere on iTunes, on Google. And then one of our artists, Gabriel Angel, teamed up with Obis and released a track called Breathe. And that just came out, so available. We have another artist named Jesus the Punk, and he just released a whole album called Sanity. Okay. And it's one of those albums that I'm very proud of to release because it's got a little bit of everything. It satisfies all the you know, music connoisseurs. Where did you find Jesus the Punk? <laughs> uh, my boy Ali Ganavi that manages the label actually found him. And okay. uh, we've been just working with him, he's great. He was one of the few artists that definitely charted really high for us. Okay. Reza is in the mix with myself and Richard Vision here at Power Tools. We're going to find out more about what events Reza has coming up and more about Saturday night sessions and releases. But now let's get back into the mix with Reza on Power Tools. Reza is in the mix here on Power Tools. Myself and Richard Vision in the studio with Reza. I got I got a quick question for you, Reza. Where do you see music heading? Because it's it's funny. Like I remember, uh, this was like ten years ago, and I remember you saying, "Man, funky stuff is gonna come in, and it's gonna be like it's gonna be like big floor funk." And I remember you saying the name, and I I even named my CD after that. Yeah. Because you just said the term like it's gonna be. Big floor, it's gonna be funky, but for the big floor, and a whole movement came in, and you're you're right in. So where do you see music heading? You know, I see all the walls going down, all the barriers going down, all the genres kind of opening up, and people collaborating as musicians, as DJs that have an ear that understand what it's supposed to sound like. And I see people bringing back artists, musicians, people playing live instruments, incorporating the dance world, kind of back to where it was in the 70s. Right, right. Is that is that part of uh, like like disclosure? I mean, that's kind of what they're doing I by think, playing live. You know, I think they definitely hit it on the head, I'm, uh, and I'm sure their uh, success is pr proving right what's happening. I think that people want something real. But I what mean, about at festival levels? I think at festival levels, you know, the same thing. I think that people like you know like Daft Punk even their release, their album that just you know won so many awards. Right, it was right back to the roots. Right. Right back to disco. So speaking of festivals, you've done many big events. You've done small, intimate events. What can we look forward to from promoter Ressa in the future? Um, we're doing definitely the Love Festival tour. It's happening in Hawaii. It's the 16th annual. We're doing it here in LA on August 16th, which is the 22nd annual. And we're starting Phoenix this year. Whoa, in whoa, whoa! 22nd annual. It started in '92, <laughs> baby. Love wow. Festival. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah, 22nd annual. Yeah, very good. See, it's a legend right here in the studio with us. Some awesome. of the people going weren't even born yet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and uh, are you doing other events that we can look forward to? Uh, definitely. We have a really secret, cool underground party happening once a month. I'm not going to really talk about it on the radio because we don't want to get the word out too much, but for those who know, it's called the Secret Night Society. Hopefully you're invited. It's so secret, I haven't even got it. Yeah, we have no idea <laughs> yeah. what it is. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get back into the mix with the rest out on Power Tools. Power Tools, great set of music. And if people wanted to pick up on these mixes that we've heard, and I know you've got other mixes, where's the best website to go to? You can definitely check out our podcast live on SaturdayNightSessions.com and it's featured on Mixcloud and iTunes and uh, just type in Saturday Night Sessions and you'll get everything. And you've featured a lot of DJs. This is not just a new thing. Like, how many DJs have you had in the mix and how, how much is there to choose from? I think we're on, like, podcast number, like, 122 now. Wow. And, you know, we've had everything from Cedric Gervais to Steve Angelo, Anton Clamorin, uh, Richard Vision, uh, David Delano, Swedish Eagle. I mean, 
All the guys that know what they're doing, we pick them out, we get podcasts. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And again, Love Fest is coming back to L.A. when? It's Saturday, August 16th. And if you want to go to the islands? Uh, it's this summer. The date hasn't been announced yet, but uh, the date will be announced for me. Check out the lovefestival.com for all the pertinent info. Okay. And Go Venture is still a place to go for more information? Definitely Go Venture. But you can go to our Facebook, which is really simple. It's uh, facebook.com forward slash DJ Reza Music, and you find out about everything. Okay. Thank you, Russ. That was awesome to have you here in the studio. I love coming to Power Tools. I've been supporting you guys since day one, man. Keep it up. Awesome. I'd like to invite you to come out this coming Thursday, April the 24th, to Luna in Pomona, Dynasty.